everybody, I am the Lazy Kiwi and welcome to episode 5 of my Barbie legacy. So, well, Barbie is about to pop, like she is going to give birth in today's episode. In fact, she's gonna give birth today. I did let her call her obstetrician and say that she wants it a C-section, because I feel like that is definitely going to be the fastest way to do this. But I did also do a little bit of a room renovation over here. This is going to be baby number two's room. So it is a really, really cute little space. I have a lot of decor in here. I kind of wanted to go for a little bit of an animal theme. So there's a few like zoo animals and stuff in here. However, it's mainly a blue and pink. That's the two colors that I went for with this room and I think it turned out a really really cute. But besides for another baby being born today, we also have a little birthday today. Blair is aging up into a toddler and I'm so excited for that. So I kind of completely forgot about the fact that I wanted you guys to name this baby and well I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna give the baby a random name like blank or something. Then I'm gonna put up a poll onto my community tab then you guys can vote for a name for the baby because yeah I just completely forgot about that. It's also gonna become a lot more hectic once this baby is born, so I am going to let Barbie make a cake for Blair's birthday now so that she doesn't have to do it tomorrow. Oh, oh, she's sparkling again. I'm assuming this is another milestone. Oh, look at her! Oh, this is too cute. What is the milestone though? Cool to stand up milestone. <laughs> I feel like Barbie really is gonna give birth at any moment. I'm gonna put the baby to rest so that we can maybe prepare Barbie's needs a little bit as well. Oh, just thinking about the fact that she's gonna have to get pregnant again is giving me a headache like this. The moods going down so fast is the most annoying part about this because my gosh, who would have thought that my closest friend would be Katarina, the crazy cat lady. She's here right now, but I'm about to take a nap, so I don't know what to tell her. You can't tell me this isn't something straight out of your nightmares. Like, oh my gosh, please go away. I'm just gonna turn around. Maybe if I don't look at it, it's gonna go away. This is such a nice little neighborhood with like the streets, people passing by all the time. There's usually a lot of people passing through this. Oh, oh, it's this guy again. I mean, I tried. What the heck? How is their friendship so good? What? When did this happen? I was trying so hard for them to be friends and now suddenly they're besties? Excuse me? This makes just no sense at all. They're both doctors. That might be it. They might be becoming besties at work. I, I have no idea. Oh, I was just about to say, is she not gonna give birth today? Oh my gosh. Okay, yeah. So let's go ahead and get her to the hospital ASAP. It's a lot later than I thought it was gonna be. Oh, not a home birth. Oh my gosh. Since it is a C-section though, it's not gonna take nearly as long as the last one did. I am obviously gonna be asking this doctor though because I mean look at that robe it is pink she knew that I was coming I could have sworn I said c-section I don't know why I cannot let her give birth am I just supposed to say I don't know give birth immediately well I did that now so I can let her give birth now I'm gonna do that because I swear I said c-section but for some reason, they were not giving me the option to go have this freaking baby. Yeah, see? It's the C-section one, so I don't know what was going on in this. But you know, it's fine. They're gonna get this little baby, and it's gonna be a happy little day. Oh, it's a boy! Oh my gosh! Okay, so you guys are gonna have to help me with names. I am gonna put up a poll, like I mentioned. So when I put up this poll, you guys can vote for whatever name you guys like the best. For now though, I am literally just gonna call this baby blank because yeah, he has no name currently. So yeah, definitely check out the community tab for that poll and vote for the baby names. Oh! Oh! Okay, yeah, that's definitely what I wanted to see today. Oh my gosh. You know what this is reminding me of? This is reminding me of that scene in Twilight where Bella gives birth. I don't know what it is about this, but... <laughs> Why is Kaysen's head all up in my business? I just want to take a few photos. Meet Baby Blank. <laughs> Currently known as Baby Blank. Oh, okay, he's gone. Oh, she's off. Okay, well... <laughs> 
I guess it is probably time to get home. Thank the sim heavens it was only one baby. I don't know what I was gonna do if it was more than one baby. I already decorated this whole entire room. I should like really. Look at him though. What a cute little baby. He also looks real old. Oh look at that. Look at that little outfit. That is the cutest thing. Oh it's too cute. It also matches the fact that he's gonna have this little space thing. Oh huh? excuse me. I won't tell anyone if you decide to give me a little nibble. A l a l a what what is I'm so sorry I I appreciate the sentiment but not not tonight maybe some other time oh what the frick I don't ever want to talk about that again okay we're just gonna ignore that that happened kiss blank's forehead I guess oh she's level six of the parenting skill this baby is going to be a baby for all of three seconds so I'm going to do everything that I possibly can with this baby like right now so work for Kaysen does start in an hour and I definitely want to age up at least one of the babies before he leaves so it's gonna be Blair I am quickly going to get my cake that I made. I also think we need to get a heating system into this house because they are currently always freezing and I don't want to live like that. Oh, she's so cute. I cannot wait to see what she's gonna look like as a toddler, but she's still gonna be real cute. Oh, oh, they're just immediately going for it. I need to take some birthday screenshots. Kaysen isn't even here. Oh my, this is just terrible. Oh, and now he has to go to work. I'm just gonna send him alone. My guy, <laughs> what the heck? Oh, this is so cute. She's trying so hard to blow out her little candles. Okay, well, oh, okay, it's, it's happening. It's happening. The, oh, there it is. Okay, I am gonna randomize for this. So toddler trait is gonna be silly, goofy, and curious. These toddlers love to tell jokes and get playful. They earn imagination skill slightly faster. That's too cute. <laughs> look at her. Okay, well, <laughs> she does look slightly creepy right now. And she does have freckles. I... Don't know if I'm gonna keep these freckles, but I definitely want to keep some freckles because she did have freckles as a little infant, so... Oh, and look at her already eating some of her cake! Oh, it's gonna be so good to not have to feed this child by myself. So I honestly think I'm just gonna age up this baby as well because I want to give Blair her little makeover. So I'm not gonna go into cast twice, you know? You feel me? <laughs> Little Blank. Oh, I hate that name. I cannot wait for the next episode when we change this name because it is just not working. We have a sensitive. These sims are prone to diaper rash, are often picky with food, and can more easily become overstimulated by too much play and social interaction. However, they also rest more peacefully through the night when soothed. Yeah, this is gonna be a whole bunch of fun. Well, at least he's cute. At least he's a little cutie patootie. Look at that little face. Okay, well. I'm gonna save my game and head into Kaz immediately because this is so exciting. Oh, look at little baby Blank. What a beautiful, <laughs> what a beautiful child. We also have Blair. I am obsessed with the freckles. I think I will tone them down a little bit because they were never this intense. But I'll, I'll see what I'll do for her. But I think without further ado, I'm just gonna magically Oof, these makeovers done. Okay, so here we have Blair all finished up. I absolutely love how she turned out. I am quickly going to blitz through all of their little outfits. Most of these we're probably never even going to see, but I'm gonna show you anyways because I love giving my little sims makeovers. And yeah, so I'm just gonna show them all to you. She has such a cute outfit portfolio. It is just so adorable. We're definitely gonna see the winter wear. We're never gonna see the summer wear, so kind of didn't spend as much time on that one. So this is a blank. That is his name currently, which is very saddening, but... <laughs> Eventually he's gonna have a really cute name because he's a really cute baby. He deserves the best little name ever. Again, a lot of these outfits we're never gonna see. The ones we are gonna see, I did put in a little bit more effort, but they are so cute. He's 
really an adorable little baby. Look at his little face. Oh my gosh. I did give him a little birthmark. I think that'll be so cute once he ages up as well. But yeah, let me know what you guys think about Blair and Blank. I, I'm not gonna keep his name Blank. Don't even try to convince me. I know some of you are going to like that. I will also toddlerify Blair's room off camera because right now there's still a bunch of infant stuff. I will also be changing this in this episode. I mean, she does need a place to go to bed. Oh, she went all the way upstairs to sit and eat her food near mommy. Look, the cat is floating. Okay, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, the baby had a little bit of an accident. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Yeah, we're definitely gonna need to fix that ASAP. She is so close to reaching level 10 of the cooking skills, so I'm definitely gonna need to work on that a little bit more, because then we'll be done with that. Her parenting is also doing really well with level 7 at this point, and we're only on baby 2. She's gonna need to get a whole nother baby as well, which we'll be working on today as well, because I want this baby done. I do not want her to be pregnant anymore. More. Luckily for me, Kaysen does have off today, so they can work on getting another baby today. So okay, we're gonna get on that as soon as possible. I think now would be a pretty good time, so I'm just gonna go ahead and say try for a pregnancy. Because, well, I want the kids to be slightly close in age. I don't want two of them to be close in age, and then one of them is just such a late-born baby that they have nothing in common at all. Hopefully this works first time, but they're gonna get to it, and I'm just gonna go look at the babies. Oh! Oh my gosh, you can have the toddler play with the infant. Oh, that's actually so cute. Oh, oh, they're done. Oh my gosh, okay, wait. <laughs> Let's take a pregnancy test. Oh, the flea market is in town as well. We might as well go to that. I mean, a little outing for the day. I do wonder if she's pregnant. I'm gonna need to take some screenshots. This, this is looking slightly concerning. Is she, what, what the heck? What do you mean? What was that reaction? Yeah. Why was she so indifferent to it? Is she not wanting kids anymore? It says she would be happy to have a child. Why was she not looking happy? I really thought she wasn't pregnant. What the? I got one screenshot from that. That is so disappointing. Well, Barbie's pregnant once again. I think I definitely do want them to go to the flea market though. I feel like that would be so much fun. But only Kaysen and Barbie who are leaving the kids at home for this one. Okay, well, I'm gonna let them take a little look-see around here. See if maybe they find something they like. I'm not really seeing too much that they would want over here. What? What the? What the heck are you doing, lady? What, what do you mean? Why the heck is Agatha knocking the Disney's little Barbie? What did she do? I don't get it. Is it the public displays of affection? Why would she do that? Hitting a pregnant lady? She's not stopping! She's literally assaulting a pregnant lady in the streets. Yeah, call the cops, Barbie. Call the cops. I don't want to be funny, but I'm not gonna let this slide. This is this is not how this is gonna go. She's not gonna hit me and get away with it. You have not heard the last of Barbie, Agatha. This will be the start of a very very bad relationship listen agatha i don't want to be the type of person who fights a old lady but you started it you fought a pregnant lady i i arguably that's kind of worse you know well this is just not what i was expecting when i was taking them out to the flea market i thought it was gonna be a nice day of what the D excuse me Listen, listen, lady. This is unacceptable behavior. You know what, Kaysen? I'm gonna get you involved because she's pregnant. She can't brawl with this lady, but you can. You for sure can. So while he's doing that, I'm just gonna let her grab a snack, not put any more stress on her. What the? Is she in love with him? No, listen, like, <laughs> you you gotta pick and choose your battles, lady. You can fight me all you want, but you're not gonna steal my man. Take that, you old hag, you little donkey. This is what you get for touching Barbie with your little purse. What the? Oh, I love this G-shade, because the shadows just make me see all of this action, and I mean, it's absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> Do I feel bad for attacking an old lady? No. No, I simply do not. Oh, she won. She she's won the battle. This is this is 
quite embarrassing and I'm not gonna lie it's really really quite simply just embarrassing like I said this is not the last you've seen of us Agatha this lady just stole our food excuse me what is wrong with the people this I am so sorry lady you you're not gonna get that freaking plate of food I have had enough of disrespectful people if she touches that I'm gonna delete her I will I well, cheat to murder her. What are you doing? I, I don't know why people are taking these risks. I know how to cheat people to death, okay? I didn't even get the chance to buy anything because everybody ran once they saw the brawl. Okay, I simply think that it's time to get out of here. Like, <laughs> they've had quite the eventful day, eh? <laughs> oh, look at this stinky girl. We're gonna have to give her a little bath. It's so weird. I think one of these CC items that she she has on is very glitchy because the way that she holds things is just so not okay. Oh, uh, for a second there I forgot she was pregnant, but then her belly grew. It, it was suddenly big again. I feel like Barbie's just always pregnant. I mean, realistically, she's been pregnant like every episode, but I mean, <laughs> she's she's pregnant a lot. Luckily, this is the last one of those because I am so done with it for now. Oh, we've got bills <laughs> so much money once again oh i hate that i am just letting barbie level up her cooking skill that i'll pay these bills but look look at this wild lady what the, what the this is probably her most dangerous pregnancy yet she's been assaulted by some old woman hit with a purse thrown with some juice and now she's throwing knives around in her kitchen <laughs> and now the cat is inside of the pot you know <laughs> this game sometimes. Oh, I also don't think I've showed you guys all of Blair's quirks. So she loves water, she hates being carried, and she loves sounds. So that is just so cute. On the other hand, Blank, I, I, I really should not get used to calling him Blank, but anyway, he is a snuggly sleeper, loves being held, and he frequently hiccups. I really love that. I think it's just so cute. Oh, she can swing on that? Oh my gosh, I did not know this. I thought it was just a normal seat and nothing else, but no, she can actually swing on this. I think the last thing we should probably do for today is call our obstetrician, because for this last birth, I want to do one I've never done before, and that's going to be a home birth. So there are a few things that I can do. I can either just do it straight into the bassinet or a water birth and I kind of want to do that one. So hopefully I remember that I wanted to do that, but I am going to choose this option and see if maybe we can do that. But with that, I do think I'm going to end this episode off here. So thank you all so, so much for watching. If you guys did enjoy today's video, please do consider liking and subscribing to my channel and I will definitely see you all in another video. Goodbye everybody!